Good morning students. I am Kirti from Computer Science Department, GSIPU College, Mysore. Today I am going to explain another C++ program to find the sum of two compatible matrices. So what is a matrix? A matrix is a collection of elements which is arranged in row and column order. It is a collection of elements. It is a collection of elements and it is arranged in a row and column order. So this is the row order and this is column order. So what is the order of this matrix? So how many rows are there? Here we have two rows and two columns. Hence, the order of this matrix is 2 cross 2 matrix. This is about matrix. So, what is the meaning of compatible matrices? See here, here we have to find the sum of two compatible matrices, which means that the column order of first matrix and the row order of the second matrix should be in the same order. See here, this consider another matrix which contains the elements with order 2 cross 2. So here, the first order represents the row and the second order represents the column. So, to be in a compatible matrix, the order of the column order of the first matrix and the row order of the second matrix should be same. See here, both are of order 2 cross 2. So, the number is same. So, that's why we call it as compatible matrices. So, this type of matrices is called as compatible matrices. So, how to perform addition? First, we have to add the elements of first element with the first element of the second matrix. That is 1 plus 5, 2 plus 6. 3 plus 7, 4 plus 8, 6, 8, 10 and 12. So the sum of two matrices, we are going to store it in the variable called C. So this is how we are going to add the two compatible matrices. Now let's write a logic for this. What is the first step? First step we have to include required header files as include iostream.h which contains iostream.h supporting file for seen and see out. Next header file is ash include conio.h ash include conio.h which contains basic functions like get chn clear screen ash include iomanip.h iomanip.h to manipulate the output on the display screen next is main function in the main function we are going to declare the required variables it's of type int a of Phi cross phi. It's a two dimensional array. As it is a two cross two matrix, we have to declare two dimensional array. B of phi phi, phi cross phi, and C of phi cross phi to store the contents of two matrices. I comma j comma m comma n m represents row and n represents column see out enter the number of rows enter 
the number of rows. See out, enter the number of columns. Enter the number of columns. Next, we are going to enter the elements of matrix A. Enter elements of matrix A. We are using two for loops to accept row and column elements. For i is equal to 0, i less than m, i plus plus. And for j is equal to 0, j less than n, j plus plus. C in a of i j. So here we have accepted the elements of matrix A. Next we are going to accept the elements of matrix B. Enter elements of matrix B. For i is equal to 0, i less than m, i plus plus. For j is equal to 0, j less than n, j plus plus, c in, b of i, j. After accepting the elements of two matrices, we are going to perform addition. That is, for i is equal to 0, i less than m, i plus plus, for j is equal to 0, j less than n, j plus plus, c of i j is equal to a of i j plus b of i j, a of i j plus b of i j. After performing addition, we are going to print the elements of C matrix. So, addition of two matrices. For i is equal to 0, i less than m, i plus plus. For j is equal to 0, j less than n, j plus plus. C out C of i j. To print the elements in horizontal, I have used an escape sequence called slash t. This is the horizontal tab. C out slash n. To print the elements in the next line, I am going to use slash n. Get ch. To hold the screen until the user presses any key on the keyboard. So this is the program to find the sum of two compatible matrices. Now let's see how to execute this program in Turbo C++. Now let's see how to execute a program to find sum of two compatible matrices. To get a new file, click on File, select New Option. So here I am going to write the name of the program. Write a C++ program to find sum of two compatible matrices. So what is the meaning of compatible matrices? The order of first matrix and the row order of second matrix should be same. So such type of matrices are called as compatible matrices.
So, here we are including the required header files IO stream dot h ash include conio dot h ash include IO manip dot h to manipulate the output on the display screen. In the main section that is in the main function I am going to declare the required variables int a of phi cross phi matrix and another matrix of b that is also phi cross phi matrix and another matrix to store the sum of two compatible matrices that is c c of phi cross phi i comma j comma m and n clear screen function to clear the previously generated output on the display screen so using c out statement i am going to enter using c out statement i am going to display the statement as enter the number of rows Using C in statement, I am going to enter the number of rows. Next, I am going to enter the number of columns. C out. Enter elements of matrix A. Enter elements of matrix A. So, using for loop, I am going to accept. So, here we are using two for loops one to accept the row elements and another to accept the accept the column elements for i is equal to 0 i less than m i plus plus to accept the row elements to accept the column elements for j is equal to 0 j less than n j plus plus c n a of i j Next, I am going to accept the elements of matrix B, elements of matrix B. For i is equal to 0, i less than m, i plus plus. For j is equal to 0, j less than n, j plus plus. C in B of I J. So, after accepting the elements of matrix A as well as matrix B, uh, we are going to add the elements of both the matrices. For I is equal to 0, I less than M, I plus plus. For J is equal to 0, J less than N, J plus plus. So, C of i j is equal to A of i j plus B of i j. C of i j is where we are going to store the sum of two compatible matrices. So, after performing addition, we are going to print the addition of two matrix is for i is equal to 0 i less than m i plus plus for j is equal to 0 j less than n 
J plus plus. See out. We are going to print the sum of two matrices that is C of i j. To print the next row elements, I am going to use slash n. Get ch function to hold the output screen until the user presses any key on the keyboard. So now I am going to save this file. So this is experiment 11. exp 11.cpp is the extension. I am going to compile this file. Press Ctrl F9. Here we have three errors. Press any key on the keyboard. So, in the line number 14, press any key. For statement missing, here we did not terminate this condition i is equal to 0 semicolon. Now, compile this file. Here, now, it is error free. We can run this file. Click on Ctrl F9. Enter the number of rows. The number of rows are 2. Enter the number of columns. It is also 2. Enter elements of matrix A. It is 1, 2, 1, 2, 4 and 7. Enter elements of matrix B. 4, 2, 6 and 8. Addition of 2 matrices. 1 plus 4 is 5. 2 plus 2 is 4. 4 plus 6 is 10. 7 plus 8 is 15. So, this is the output of sum of two compatible matrices. To quit from this MS DOS box, click on File, select Quit option. Here you have to type exit command. In the next session, I will come with a new program. Thank you.